Lobby Tools, Florida's legislative intelligence company. Subscribe today to Florida's leading policy, budget, and campaign tracking service. Request a free trial today at LobbyTools.com. Imagine water from here ending up here in the water you drink. Legislation dubbed Toilet to Tap and approved by lawmakers would set standards for reclaiming wastewater and pumping it back into the ground. An ever-growing demand for water has put a heavy strain on the state's aquifers. Sponsors say pumping reclaimed water back into the ground could help future supply issues. The problem, according to environmentalists and health experts, the reclaimed water is treated human wastewater. While the water is treated and cleaned, opponents say certain contaminants like medications and nutrients can still end up in the final product. Aliki Moncrief, executive director of the Florida Conservation Voters, says the nutrients threaten the health of Florida's 700 springs, which are fed by the aquifers. We're talking about putting water down there that has higher nutrients than our springs can allow. Um, we should think twice about that. And trace amounts of medications left in the water could have negative health effects for the 90 percent of Florida residents who rely on the aquifers for drinking water. There have not been filters that have been invented that have been shown to be effective. I think nobody wants to drink, you know, filtered poopy water. The governor's received more than 3,000 signed petitions asking him to veto the toilet to tap bill. Scott has until April 10th to make a decision. In Tallahassee, I'm Jake Stofan.